Shaywitz Dyslexia Screen is an efficient, reliable, and user-friendly dyslexia screening tool for young students who may be at risk for dyslexia. It was created by Dr. Sally Shaywitz, a global leader in dyslexia. It emphasizes phonological, linguistic, and academic performance based on teacher observations. The Shaywitz Dyslexia Screen was developed specifically for young students. It will be ultimately available for kindergarten through third grade within the Ames of Plus platform beginning in the fall of 2018. Kindergarten through grade two will be available earlier in the spring. Administration takes less than five minutes per student with an easy to use teacher friendly rating scale. Administration, scoring, and reporting is completely digital within Ames of Plus. Since the Shaywitz is an add-on module to Ames of Plus, you'll most likely already have put students and teachers and classes into your account. This was done either through a data import or manual entry. If you need more information on how to do this, please refer to the documentation and videos provided to you with your new account, or go to the management section within the help files. This segment will cover how to access and complete the rating scales within the Ames of Plus platform. First, log in to your Ames of Plus account. Leave the Students tab selected and choose Shaywitz Dyslexia screen from the drop-down menu. Enter your roster name into the roster field. You can choose grade levels that you want to have show up on your list, and then click View and Refresh. This will give you a list of all the students within the filter options that you've selected. Now find the student that you wish to rate and click onto the paper pencil icon in the Assess column. A new digital record form window will open. Read the directions and click Begin. Rate each of the items on your observations of the student. If you need more information about what an item means, click onto the information icon. Be sure to move on to the next page. Once you're done making your ratings, click onto the score button at the top right corner of their screen and then click on to OK. Your student's score will populate into the screen. They'll be identified as not at risk or at risk. Your reports may be viewed as a group with individual student data, as a group summary, and as individual student results. We'll now go through how to view each of these reports. The first will be the individual student summary data. If you are on the screen to access rating scales, you have already found the report that shows a group of students and their individual summary data. Remember that this data is accessed by clicking under the Students tab and then selecting Shaywitz Dyslexia screen from the drop-down menu. Then make sure to use the filter to select the group of students that you wish to see. Click View and Refresh, and from this view, you can sort your list of results by student name, grade level, whether they've been assessed or not, form number, date, the rater, and their classification. Notice that in the filter, you can also opt to see only certain classifications. You can access a PDF version of your selections by clicking onto the Export button at the upper right-hand corner of your screen. The report will populate for download in the Notifications area when it is ready. In addition to being able to view individual student data from the Shaywitz Dyslexia Screen page with all students together, you can go into an individual student's student profile and be able to see the exact items that were rated. To do this, from your Shaywitz Dyslexia screen page, 
click on to the little icon next to the student's name to link to your student profile. Here you're going to notice that the student's Aims of Plus screening results are available as well as any monitoring results that they might have. And you're going to also see their Shaywitz Dyslexia screen summary. If you would like to see the items that were rated, click onto the printer icon. And when this is ready, it's going to pop up into your notifications area. Now you can see that the report is ready. Click onto the icon and then click onto the paper clip next to the report that you had just requested. Here you'll be able to see the individual items that the teacher had rated. This will be in PDF format. These are going to be the steps in how to access and view group level data. Click onto the Groups tab and select Shaywitz Risk Report from the drop down menu. Use the filter to find the group or groups that you wish to display. Your roster selection options will vary depending on your level of access. You can customize this by grade level, classification, and demographics if you wish. Then click on to view and refresh. You can export this and any report to PDF format by clicking onto the export button at the upper right hand corner of the screen. When the report is available, it will show up in the notifications area. This concludes our session on how to use the Shaywitz Dyslexia screen within AIMS Plus.